it's Sarah and today I'm going to be talking about how to get cheap tickets to Broadway shows. Now if you're visiting the city or if you live in the city and you want to go to Broadway you'll quickly realize that the tickets can be extremely expensive and if you want the best seat in the house you kind of have to pay top dollar but today I'm going to be going through five ways that you can get discounted or cheap tickets to some of the best shows that are playing today here in New York. Now the classic way is to wait in line on the day of the show at the TKTS by TDF booth that's in the center of Times Square near the Red Steps. Here you'll find practically 50% off all tickets for all shows except for the mega hits. There are two other locations besides the Times Square one. The two locations are near Lincoln Center's David Rubenstein Atrium, which is on Broadway and 62nd Street. The great part about this location is actually it's indoors, which is a huge bonus, especially when the weather's not good and in the winter that is like... Oh my god, that is such a blessing to be able to wait inside because it's so freezing, especially January. The other TKTS booth is located in downtown Brooklyn. This is on the corner of J Street and Myrtle Avenue. If you want to go to a matinee show, make sure you go the day before because they sell those tickets uh, a day early. A matinee show, it normally happens around 2 p.m., whereas if you're going to an evening show, you want to go the day of that show, and that's when you can get 50% off those tickets. One important thing to know is that you can only buy six tickets per person and that there is a $5 to $6 fee on top of the ticket cost, which is actually substantially lower than what you'll get online. All ticketing fees benefit the not-for-profit TDF, which helps bring the power of performing arts to everyone through initiatives like their autism-friendly performances. So that's one way. Let's go into the next way right now. Now let's dive right into number two, which is using the Today Takes app. This is beneficial because it allows you to get discounted tickets up to a month in advance. Using the Today Takes app helps give you a better idea of what show you'll see and you can kind of plan your schedule a little bit in advance. Now, on this app, you may not get as steep of a discount as you would get at the TKTS by TDF booth but you will be able to book in advance, which is a huge benefit, especially if you want to plan a lot of things in New York and you don't want to leave stuff up to chance. However, there are a few other options for online ticket sales. There's four websites in particular that you can uh, use as a resource if you don't find the show that you want or the price that you want of that show on Today Ticks. The websites you should check are New York Show Tickets, Broadway Box, Theater Mania and Gold Star. And I'll link to all of those things below this video. Keep in mind that you're gonna have a higher uh, per ticket fee on top of that. So it's gonna be about 10 to $15 and just prepare for that. So on top of the discount, just a heads up. If you wanna get discounted tickets to the more popular shows, now I'm talking Hamilton, The Lion King, Wicked, Chicago, things like that, then you're going to need to try the rush tickets or the lottery strategy. Now, rush tickets is when you show up to the box office the moment it opens, which is normally around 10 a.m. most days, and they sell essentially whatever's left, which may not be the best seats, but it's about $20. I did this for Chicago a few years ago, and it worked out great. The other option is doing the lottery. Now more and more shows are starting to do this, especially the big popular ones. This is where you go to the theater a few hours before the show starts and you write your name on a piece of paper. They then draw a winner out of all the people that entered their names and that person will get uh, severely discounted tickets and sometimes the seats are fantastic. I'm just going to go through a few of the offers that there are going on right now that's been pretty consistent over the last year and these are things that you can check out when you're here if you want to see some of the best the biggest hits on Broadway the most competitive lottery tickets are Hamilton of course they offer 46 seats at $10 every day the other one is Harry Potter and the Cursed Child which they hold their lottery once a week on Fridays 
But to see a list of all the lotteries that are happening while you're here, you can go to Broadway for the Broke People. I'm putting their website below so you can check out that and that will give you access to a lot of the big hits that aren't normally found at the TKTS by TDF booth or today's Tix apps and all the other ways that you can get discount tickets. show you want to see is not available on uh, the other ways that I mentioned then I recommend just going straight to the box office where you can avoid the expensive service fee associated with buying online and also if you go the day of the show sometimes the seats that were previously held for house seats or premium seats that didn't get sold will now be released back to the public and they'll lower the prices of those and that way you can get in to pretty decent seats at a, a lower cost than what you would normally get. The other great thing about this is that the box office attendee can help guide you as to where to sit in the theater to get the best seat for your money. Now, number five sadly doesn't apply to everyone, but it's be a young person. So if you're under the age of 35 or 30, depending on the program, you can actually qualify to get discounted tickets through many of the nonprofit theater organizations here in the city. Theater goers ages 18 to 35 can buy tickets to the Roundabout Theater Company for just $25 per show by joining its Hip Ticks program. You can join Lincoln Center's Theater Link Ticks program, which offers $32 tickets at all shows. And then finally, you have Manhattan Theater Club's 30 Under 30 program, which allows patrons 30 or younger to buy tickets for $30. Now, if you're not qualified in one of those categories, but you're a student or you're a teacher, then you're actually in luck in a different way because you qualify for discount tickets through other programs. Librarians, teachers, and students can pick up vouchers for 30 to 50% off through the school theater ticket program. And students ages 13 to 18 can buy $5 tickets to certain off and off off-Broadway productions through the High Five Tickets to the Arts. Now for some bonus tips. So I actually used to work on Broadway and I know a bit more about Broadway than the average guide would know and for that reason I wanted to share two little tips for going to see a Broadway show in addition to the ones I already shared. Number one, if you're here in January that is the cheapest time to see Broadway shows and as far as the day of the week that's cheapest, generally Tuesdays and Wednesdays or matinee performances midweek are the cheapest. So aim for those and if you can stack a discount on top of that then you are set and you are seeing that show for the lowest price possible. So good for you, great work, yes. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, follow me on Instagram at Sarah Funky, and watch my other videos on New York. I have tons of them on tourist traps, things to do, things to eat, and much, much more. I will see you next time. Bye.